If you are looking for the best pit bikes, here's a list you must see. We made this list based on our personal preference and sorted it based on their features, prices, quality, durability, a reputation of the manufacturers, and customer feedback. Also, we've included options for every type of customer. So, let's get started. At the first position of our list, we have XPRO 125cc Pit Bike. For the best overall power, performance, and durability, the choice has to be the XPRO 125cc Pit Bike. It features a powerful 125cc 4 strong engine that really moves. With 7.75 horsepower and 7500 RPM, this bike will get you around the track with ease. It's got a maximum speed of 60 miles per hour. The semi-auto clutch is a great option for newer riders who may not yet be super familiar or comfortable with a 125 class bike. It's equipped with the rugged, knobby 14-inch front and 12-inch rear wheels for confident traction on a multitude of terrains. Front and rear hydraulic disc brakes provide quick and precise braking. The front suspension features XR70 replica forks with springs and oil damper. Rear suspension is a non-adjustable 9.5-inch monoshock. The speed bike has a small weight capacity of only 130 pounds, so it's not great for heavier riders. It's got a 30-day parts warranty, so be sure to check all components immediately upon arrival. As some users have noted leaky gas tanks right from the start, this bike cannot be sold or shipped to California. Moving on to the next, at number 2 with X-Pro Bolt 50cc Dart Bike. The X-Pro Bolt 50cc Pit Bike comes with a two-stroke air-cooled 50cc engine. The small yet capable engine is enough to boost the bike to a top speed of 25 mph. Another great thing about this bike is it only weighs around 50 pounds, so it's light and agile too. It also features a maximum weight capacity of 132 pounds. Xpro is on our list of a couple of times, so you know it's an excellent brand that understands how to craft a pit bike. The specific bike has front and rear disc brakes for quick and responsive braking and improved handling. This also makes it easier to handle on rough roads, even for new riders. It has a heavy-duty frame that makes it more resilient and reliable. As far as downsides go, the bull pit bike isn't the fastest as it only comes with 50cc. Also, it may be difficult to start for young riders. The number 3 position is held by Coolster 70cc Pit Bike. The Coolster 70cc Pit Bike is an ideal and durable choice for kids or beginners or just getting into the sport. It's a quick and fun option for tearing up some mud or riding on trails, ideally suited for kids ages 7 to 13. It has a maximum weight capacity of 130 pounds. It's also got a forgiving semi-automatic transmission with 4 gears and no clutch to mess with. It does, however, have a backward shifting pattern as compared to most pit bikes, which takes some getting used to. The 70cc 4-stroke engine offers 5.4 for horsepower and 8500 RPM, which is plenty of power for younger riders. The reliable kickstart fires up on the first try almost every time. With a top speed of 30 mph, kids can go fast but not too fast. This bike comes partially assembled, but it's recommended that you hire a professional to complete the assembly. However, many users report being able to quickly and easily assemble the bike on their own. The biggest complaint is that the backward shifting pattern. Also, some users have reported receiving bikes with scratches and dents on them, so be sure to examine your bike thoroughly upon arrival. Next at number 4, we have Apollo DBX18 125cc dirt bike. For bigger and more seasoned dirt bike riders, the Apollo DBX18 125cc dirt bike is a great choice. The four-stroke, single-cylinder 125cc engine is powerful and performance-oriented. It's got a top speed of 55 miles per hour, which is very respectable for a bike this size. Some users recommend adding an aftermarket carburetor to improve acceleration if you're a larger adult who's looking to be competitive. The four-speed manual transmission is easy to shift and gets praise for reliability. The heavy-duty steel frame, sizable 17-inch front, and 14-inch rear tires are great for taller riders. It's got an impressive weight capacity of 185 pounds. Rugged dual suspension and hydraulic disc brakes allow you to confidently control the bike on a wide variety of terrain. As with most pit bikes on our list, this one requires some assembly upon arrival. One consistent complaint is that the directions are basically kindling for your fireplace, but do have a couple of helpful diagrams, making assembly take much longer than with some other models. Larger riders complain that the seat is not padded enough and is uncomfortable on longer rides. 
The number 5 position is held by Tau Pit Bike DB14. This bike is an ideal choice for the lighter weight rider. It's also easy to handle and good for teenagers or younger adults who need time to be more experienced before handling a stronger bike. It has a 110cc air-cooled 4-stroke engine. This gives it a top speed of 31 miles per hour. The engine is manual kickstart as well. It has a semi-automatic transition which is not common for the market and it's excellent for newer riders. This bike does require some assembly so you need to be willing to take the time and investment to get things going. It has dual disc brakes, all-terrain tires and a very lightweight design. While still being designed for smaller riders, it has enough clearance to go over nearly any terrain. However, the bike is on the cheaper end, so there are some reported issues with quality, durability and functionality, especially at higher altitudes or in extreme weather. The number 6 position is dominated by X-Pro 70cc Pit Bike. Another great option for beginners and kids, the X-Pro 70cc Pit Bike offers a top speed of 30 mph, which is super fun and fast for novice riders. The 70cc 4-stroke engine takes straight gasoline and doesn't require mixing of gas, making it easy to maintain and reliable. A semi-automatic 4-speed transmission is a breeze for kids to learn on. This bike features a durable 420 chain with 14T front and 37T rear sprockets that are rust and corrosion resistant. The bike's dual suspension is a respectable CRF50 replica fork on the front and an 8.5-inch non-adjustable monoshock on the rear. With a 24-inch seat height and a 130-pound weight limit, this bike will easily carry kids of several different ages, weights and heights. For the price, it's an excellent way for kids to try out the sport. If you have kids who are more seasoned at pit bike riding, though this model will probably be a bit of disappointment as far as power and durability are concerned. Moving on to the next at number 7 with X-ProHawk DLX 250 Dirt Bike. If you want style, power and performance all in one, check out the X-ProHawk DLX 250 Dirt Bike. This beefy 250cc 4-stroke air-cooled engine is one of the most powerful on our list. We also like that this top quality bike has a 5-speed manual transmission, whereas most of our other recommendations only have 4-speed transmissions. A 21-inch front tire and an 18-inch rear tire are great for taller, stronger adult riders. This bike is fast. It's got a top speed of over 68 miles per hour and offers 11.5 horsepower, letting you tear up some trails and leave others in dust. Hydraulic disc brakes and double inverted shocks on the front suspension are some nice upgrades compared to some other models on the market. Weighing over 300 pounds and coming in as the highest priced dirt bike on our list, this is a great option for kids or novice riders. This bike also has a 330 pound weight capacity, which is another top of the list spec in our recommendations. The number 8 position is held by Razor Dart Rocket SX500 Micra Electric Motocross Bike. The Razor Dart Rocket SX500 Micra Electric Motocross Bike gets a nod for being an affordable, environmentally friendly option that's ideal for brand new riders. This fully electric pit bike is inspired by the famous motocross rider Jeremy Magra. So kids love it, and parents love the low maintenance and quiet operation of the electric motor compared to the typical gas-powered engines. This beginner bike offers a fun yet very safe top speed of up to 15 miles per hour and up to 40 minutes of continued use before needing a recharge. While it's definitely not a competition-ready bike, it's pretty much guaranteed to get your kid to go outside and play and off their electronic devices. This bike has a max rider capacity of 175 pounds, which is surprisingly substantial thanks to the rugged frame and durable dual suspension. Large tires offer a smooth and grippy ride, which is great for younger riders who are learning to get a feel for a pit bike. One thing we don't love about this bike is the long 12-hour recharge time on the battery. Next at number 9, we have YCF Biggie. YCF is a French brand with factories based in China, a great concept that helped reintroduce the pit craze back to the world of biking. Although these pit bikes aren't built for competition, they're unbeatable value for money as a first bike or laser bike. The biggest pro of the YCF is the price. It's one of the best cheap Chinese pit bikes on the market. Great for a first bike to have some fun around the pits. If you're a pit bike fan, you'll be familiar with the starter chat. The YCF has an electric and kick starter, which is bang on in the pit bike terms. Plus, the engine is punchy and the seat height is impressive. It's clear the bike is the work of a former MX rider, nothing is missed out and the price is on point. 
it's hard to find the disadvantages of the YCF pit bike. Things that come to mind are the rear part of the bike, sitting slightly too high. With a bit of lowering, the balance would be loads better. Plus, the kickstart shaft is known to be awkwardly positioned, catching your legs when riding. Finally, the number 10 position is dominated by Kawasaki KLX 110. Kawasaki is a Japanese brand well known in the biking world for producing some of the best bikes around. High quality parts with lots of power and performance engineered by experience. Kawasaki bikes win a lot of races and have more champions than any other manufacturer. Essentially, they make top bikes for winning races. The Kawasaki KX is a kid's MX model, which means high quality parts for a pit bike. A kid's model to fit kids and adult needs. Kawasaki is a high quality and reliable, you know, what you're getting with Japanese motorcycles. And it's always top notch. Competition heritage is a huge pro for Kawasaki. They've won lots of races, meaning their bike are made to win. In every sense of the word, they're widely known and therefore manufacturer support is easy to find. It takes all the boxes. Price-wise, it's not cheap. The Kawasaki is pretty expensive for a bike to throw around at the weekends. Team Green has built a kids' competition MX bike. Adults might need to consider upgrades, which means more money. That's all for today. We upload product review videos every single day. So, don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell button for the upcoming video notifications.